Hello and welcome to this A-Shampoo Photo Optimizer 8 video tutorial. This tutorial is all about enhancing your photos. I'll show you how to auto-optimize your photos, fix perspective issues and use favorites to access your most frequently used tools more quickly. Let's get started. Once launched, drag and drop the photo into the editing area. You can also drop multiple photos at once. Click Auto Optimize to have Photo Optimizer analyze and enhance your photos fully automatically. The button is so prominently placed and colored, you can barely miss it. The results are truly impressive. The colors of the houses look much more vibrant now, and most of the gray is gone. The whole photo also looks much sharper. By dragging the separator line, you can get a better impression of what individual sections looked like before and after the optimization. You've probably noticed the houses look like they're about to fall over. Let's fix that now. This issue is especially prevalent when you're taking shots of buildings from a bottom position. It will make walls seem to tilt slightly backwards, as illustrated by the red lines here. Select Correction followed by Perspective to access the perspective-related settings. The lines in my photo are vertically misaligned, so I'll use the vertical setting. By dragging the markers, I then align the guidelines with the walls. I'm using the outer edges of the buildings. Bear in mind that the tool will work just as well with the two inner edges. Fixing the perspective is achieved by rotating and shearing the photo. This invariably creates new empty space around the edges. Use the options under border to determine how the program will handle that space. I'm going for a white border around the photo. I can then clip the border as shown later. Make sure to enable extend border as the program will otherwise zoom into the photo to fill the available space. While this works great for minor adjustments, I recommend you use Extend Border for all major corrections. Let's apply the settings. As you can see, the vertical edges of the buildings now align perfectly with the guidelines. All that's left is for me to clip the crooked edges using the cropping tool to create a straight photo. If you like, you can now apply artistic effects to further enhance your shot. You'll find a rather large selection of them in the effects category. I've grown fairly fond of the image aging effect. The preview list makes it easy to find the one I like and I can instantly apply the effect to my photo. To help you access your most frequently used tools more quickly, we've added a favorites category to Photo Optimizer. Here's how you use it.
That's it for today. You've now seen a short introduction to the exciting world of photo optimization with Eshampoo Photo Optimizer. Make sure to try out the other amazing tools and don't worry, you can always go back to your original images at the click of a button. Have fun and see you next time!